Well, hello everybody. I wanted to show you this is this this is this is my uh, hammock that I showed in my video before. And I've come up with a new way to hook it up. I made some new tree straps out of this inch and a half webbing. And I've got an inch and a half metal buckle that I use. something <laughs> but I sewed this loop here through the uh, hammock so that I have something permanent to hook to and then this buckle stays on the hammock and I've got this here. Ah! <laughs> oh god. Damn Larry. <laughs> Get off Larry. Larry the cat. Larry the cat. I knew you was around here somewhere. And, th and this is Ranger Kooky. You I all know Ranger Kooky. If you know me, you know Ranger Kooky. I'm Ranger Kooky from Virginia. I'm come up here. Well really, we both come out here to uh, do a camp out. Me and Tom and Clintwood and, <laughs> and Larry. Larry the cat. <laughs> so we we kind of met in the middle in Alabama from Louisiana and Kentucky. And uh, pretty good little ride on the motorcycle. About a seven hour ride. <laughs> you got any rain on your way here? Yeah, yeah, I got rained on. I, I had to stop under a few bridges and with the trolls, you know. So, uh, <laughs> what are you doing here today? Uh, how are how you you're, you're putting your kit? Uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm keeping it simple this time. Just We just got a uh, hammock and a little tarp that needs to be bigger, but I've got my poncho I can throw over that too, so. And, uh, like nice I little said, sit up there. You just wrap the uh, tree strap around and then run it through this buckle and then you just pull it as tight as you want to and it locks. Nice little system there. And if you don't feel safe, you could, you could throw a little. But I've jumped up and down in it and it's never fell or nothing. Well, he, um, uh, Larry wanted to meet you. He finally met you. <laughs> he stalked you and he found you. So Larry, it's time to go. Oh shit, I'm gonna stay. <laughs> Too bad, you gotta go. <laughs> We're gonna go check out the you rest like, of the camp. I like the sound it stays. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Larry, it's time for you to go. <laughs> Hang on, let me uh, send y'all on your way. All right, we're gonna check our camps out. Why don't you come along? Hey, let me get this thing moving. Right, right, right. Um, right here, Mr. Tom is setting up his tent tent between these two trees at our campsite. Notice I camp next to the water. <laughs> yeah. I've got some water right there. And we brought our families out here. Well, I brought my, my part of the family. Look at Don's motorbike. Th this is my motorcycle I rode down here. He rode in the rain. This rode in the rain the down Ranger here. Kooky. So, yeah, the old, the old girl done good. She done good. Damn, got you got GPS here. and everything in this thing. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, we got a GPS and I got to charge all my batteries and all up for my cigarettes and everything. All right, everything. well come on with me and I'll uh, show you my campsite. Whoa. Look, here's another bush chair that... Bush chair. <laughs> and look, I gave Tom this one since he came out here to see me. We trade some gifts. We, we love it. another. We he picked the green one, not the black one. We, we love us some bush chairs. <laughs> So I gave him a little gift. I don't hope he don't forget it when he takes out of here. Hey, come on over and see. And look what this Tom made for me. Having the, the fellow who created this thing beside you is a good thing. Thank you, Tom. Appreciate that. I'm glad you like that. I, oh, I do. I love well. it. I meant, the minute I saw it, and you said you could put more knives on it. I thought you'd put your arm in it and you fling it around or something. <laughs> And yes, everybody, I'm the real deal. I am a camper and survivalist person. I do uh, do a lot of camping, but right now the weather is so hot. That's why we came out here, Oak Alley. I mean, Oak Mountain. Oak, Oak Mountain campground. Take crap ground to camp up, and my friend Tom came along with us. 
See, he, he's doing a little better because he come up north a little bit to cool off and I had to come down south, so it's actually hotter down here than it was in Kentucky. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just gonna go around our campsite. We'll, we'll, I'm gonna check out some camps here. Now this this is a ranger setup and he, he's way more extravagant than I am. He's he's got the bug bug uh, screen and there's no way he's getting wet and uh yeah, um, I brought a, a bigger privacy tarp, and because it's the weather, we're gonna be out here for a week. I didn't want a chance of getting wet, because a hammock, your tarp, and the rain gets right here, splashes dirt all over your your hammock, and you get wet. So I brought this for privacy. It's multiple use, privacy yeah. and um, rain. Then over here, I'll show you. I brought extra gear. Usually this is uh, this is way too much but i'm out here for a whole week he's gonna be out here for a week for I, i'm only gonna be out here like two nights yeah if i was out here for like two days this is all i needed right here that's all i needed and he's that's the exact same backpack that i've got we've got the same backpack it's a large uh not the alice pack molly two large molly two pack now i did add a new uh new system it was another i put these two together and I put a um, a little hammock. Now this hammock, I can just sit in there, relax, have a meal, or put my gear on here to keep the animals from eating it. Because uh, out here we got coons. Yeah, we're having a raccoon problem <clears throat> right now. And squirrels, they keep running away with all our stuff. So I and just the armadillos. Out, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I just put this baby off the ground. And if I want, I can sit on this thing, relax. You know, I have a nice whatever. Then I cover it up with a small sun tarp that I got at Walmart. They don't sell this color no more. They sell black. Black gets hot during the summer. Yeah. It's, it, it's good for winter because during winter you want to be warm. So a black tarp draws off heat. Yeah. And I put my uh, my sleeping bag and my um, under quilt so it airs out. Because if you don't air your bag out, I open it up and you compact it all the fibers get in one spot so you have to fluff it up yeah just like a pillow but this is the uh, new system I'm trying an extra hammock for my gear plus I'm camping out here for a week like I said and yes I am the real deal I am a survivalist campless some people think I'm just I don't know about him, but I know my crap. <laughs> you watch my videos, survival. And I got my family over here. Turn around one. We got Trista, Mr. Telesta, and you threw my Larry. Why didn't you make <laughs> That's Annalise. I'm Trista. Oh, whatever. Y'all the same to me. Uh, no, hang on now. I, I want to hear some introductions. Who, who are who are you? Hi, I'm Annalise. Now, what's your name? Annalise. Annalise? Yeah. Hi. And what Trista. is your name? Trista. Trista and Annalise. Oh, not, they're not the wine guy. And we've got we've got a Brittany. grouchy, brooding teenager down there, so I don't know. She just... My sister and my niece is washing clothes. So, all right. Well, I come out here, and me and Tom has a uh, meet. We are camping. But too bad, Donnie. I wish you came out here with us to uh, the camp with us, but you had to work. Damn you. <laughs> damn you, work. Yeah. <laughs> damn you, bills. Yeah, damn bills, you bills to pay. <laughs> he could have had a week off, but he, he had to work. So, all right, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this is Tom Chitwood. And I hope you enjoy this crazy little video of us camping. We might have something later on, maybe some bush cooking yeah we might do some cooking a little later or something okay. there we go <laughs> can you spot the stds in this video can you <laughs> all right all right i'm ranger cookie we are out of here top of the mountain <laughs> You know what? I want to see how good my lens is. Let's just go get it.
<laughs> Look at this friggin' trail we're coming down here. <laughs> You have to be a billy goat to come go. down this sucker. That is a big old fat timber rattler. Focus. He is just, he's just chilling out, just hanging out. Don't come this way, buddy. You keep going while you was going. If he keeps coming this way, I'm going to shut this off. <laughs> Get out of here. Let's see if I can get a close up of his face. Focus. There we go. Don't look at me. Don't come over here. I suppose the park officials would frown if I got out my pistol and had to shoot that thing. <laughs> they, they frown on that sort of thing. <laughs> Especially at the wildlife refuge and hospital. <laughs>